What's up guys, my name is Your Heroes and welcome back to Gates of Hell. Now, five months ago, roughly, I showed a video about how to use smoke mechanics and from that video it actually did really, really well. And I'll actually link it down below because even Gates of Hell, people who developed the game said that this was really, really useful and said well done. Now if you haven't checked out the video then I highly recommend it because that video shows you you know the mechanics of how smoke works and I used it on our infantry here but what I didn't explain in that video is that there's actually other ways other units in the game that can use smoke as well now all of this can be really really useful but then again how do you actually use smoke on other units besides infantry because in that other video I did explain on how to use smoke on an infantry and what you do for the infantry as I'll quickly just summarize it of it is that you can go down to the bottom left and you can see that this guy does not actually have any grenades so I actually just really just mess up this part of the video here oh that is definitely not a good start oh I thought the regular infantry had a smoke grenade obviously not so what I was meant to say is is that there are certain units in the game that can use smoke and in that other video five months ago on that video I just showed you how to throw smoke with infantry but as I said that there are there is other units in that get in this game that can use smoke and what I'll show you is that by basically for this uh, for this infantry I'll basically show you you can either press f3 on him or manually do it from the bottom left for, for quickness I'll just press f3 you can see it's still kind of it's highlighted there and as you can see that uh, I'm gonna throw it and there you go that is how you use smoke with a with a infantry now believe it or not this game actually has updated since and the smoke is slightly different as you can see that from in that previous video where I did show smoke is that there was smoke actually coming out of the grenade but this time it's a different type of smoke this is called willy peat smoke which basically what it is is that when you explode fire comes out and as well as smoke now this could be very very useful for against infant against infantry lightly armored vehicles maybe slightly armored vehicles you know proper ones but probably not useful more like art <coughs> artillery pieces and using that can help set a fire to infantry but also be able to block your view now as i said there are other units in the game and those units can be ranging from tanks to proper artillery pieces and even howitzers and even tiny little mortars like these which can be effectively useful because mortars rate of fires are absolutely godlike now i'm going to be showing you how to use um, smoke on a tank because believe it or not um, not a lot of people know how to use smoke in a tank because you know even though when you take control and it actually shows you at the bottom it says mouse 4 a lot of people don't know what mouse 4 is so I'm, I can't really bring my mouse up to the camera I can try is that um, this button here um, I'm looking at my camera but this button here that I'm highlighting uh, that I'm hopefully covering the right one yep this one here that my fingers on shows the exact one that you need to press to to throw smoke or out a tank and as you can see you and if I do it now and as you can see a smoke just popped out there so there's one you can you can do as many as you like um, or as actually not as many as you like you can only do two but as you can see that is how you pop smoke in a tank and for artillery wise you can do it for um, you can choose the type of ammunition it does and then you can fire hopefully hopefully this is the right shell it's not as you can see uh, so make sure you always load the the right shell because um it doesn't always do that you need to actually there you go so as soon as it says uh, he uh, willy pete wp stands for willy pete so once and you can actually see on the kind of the wee loading thing it says white phosphorus which also stands for um basically willy pete which is the same as just white phosphorus which is fire with smoke as far as i'm aware if you guys probably know information about it then let me know in the comments down below um so basically this m12 has it as well if you fire it as well from here and as you can see 
it has the same results as the infantry and the tank but basically in a larger widespread but this is all good and all that but what happens let's say you want to use it against in a proper battle let's have a look to see what it's like from my perspective but also from the enemy's perspective the germans or russians so let's have a look all right guys so here we are now if you're wondering why i have just spawned loads of units now this is on a tested this is on like tested so everything you see here is just for experiment purposes for the new smoke mechanic now as i said at the at the start you know that the mechanic is different and what i'll show you is in a second that i am now in battle in the pvp and as you can see we have infantry enemy coming up right now now you see the infantry is approaching now the first thing that the enemy do will deploy smoke as as well myself so i'm going to deploy some smoke oh my god well i would spawn smoke if no one actually died and i forgot how different this game is a wee bit so we are just going to take the and we're going to just going to take care of some enemies but as you can see that the smoke is actually deployed so it makes it more difficult and as you can see that i have deployed smoke as well now from my perspective as you can see that i cannot actually see the enemy even if i take direct control i cannot see anyone unless i outline them and f and if you go to the enemy's perspective it is very much the same um, even though half of them are dead but you can see from their perspective that they are not able to see me as well but with the willy p the reason that it's different from the original smoke is that because of with the original smoke you just threw the grenade and then smoke came out as when the grenade came out is that the fact that it's you know this is now willy p makes it a whole lot more interesting for battle wise and it makes it smoke a lot more effective when dealing with you know infantry and especially it comes to artillery as i have said before that is not the right artillery i meant to do and um, it was this one i think i just brought out the wrong unit um but that's okay you know it's fine we can still able to use it here i believe this 4.5 inch does have it uh, does not have okay i thought this thing would have had a uh, i don't know where to actually use this uh Okay, I'm absolutely just failing. Okay, with the, some tanks, actually, if you look at it with some tanks, these tanks can actually use, uh, like the one, the M4A3 105 here, can actually use um, Willy Pete. And I'll show you what you mean by right now. Once this tank is loaded, I'm going to show you what I mean. If you're going kind of third person here, and, and you actually use it on lightly armored vehicles as well, which is actually probably most useful. It's because when you use it on like that, as you can see that I've just used it on the Willy Pete there, on a lightly armoured vehicle, you see, it's gone up to flames, I've just destroyed a whole vehicle with fire, but as well as smoke. So that means, what I'm also doing is that, even though they're getting cover, it also shows that I'm actually giving cover to myself. And I've just realised that they have brought out a Yag Tiger, so at this point, I think I'm going to end the video there guys. So that is it for today, I hope you do understand the full mechanic of the new smoke. Willy Pete, uh, which hopefully makes a wee bit more sense and it is updated to, you know, make to make it better actually for games and for gameplay. So on that guys, that is it for today. Thank you so much for watching and Orange Sport and I will see you in the next video. See you later and goodbye.